Joey Strube, Torque Link Engineering. Today we are going to show you how easy it is to flash a Skidoo 850. Step one, find the diagnostic port. It's right next to the recoil or where the recoil would be. Push the tab in. Pull it apart. Find your cord for the torque link, push it together, wait till you hear the click. Step two, grab the USB cord from your torque link, plug it into the USB port on your computer, and the red light will start blinking. Step three, grab your power cord, plug it into the torque link, you'll notice the red light turns green. Step four, make sure that the kill switch is off and the tether is unplugged. Step five, we've got to log in to our Torque Link app. Now that we're logged in our Torque Link app, it'll say the Torque Link is connected. That means that we've done all the prior steps correctly. So then we have to hit next. Since this is a Skidoo 850, we want to select Bikeman Skidoo 850. That'll give us all the tunes for it. We'll roll down until it says Connect to ECU. So now you can see it's connected to the ECU and it gives us all available tunes. Uh, you have the 10 horse, 20 horse, 30 horse, and 45 horse. So let's go ahead and put the 45 horse 100 octane tune in this thing. Now at this point, if it starts clicking, it means that you did not turn off your ignition. So if it stalls at 3% and you hear the relays click and it doesn't go any further, it says flash failed, it means you missed one of those steps. The reason we have to unplug the tether and turn off the kill switch is the fuel pump will try to kick on and our little power adapter doesn't have enough power to power up the fuel pump. So by turning them off, we're just powering up the ECU with the cord and everything's happy. Easy as that, the flash is in there, ready to go do some wheelies. We've created this Torque Link software and system, so dummy proof and user friendly that anybody can use it. Uh, you just have to have a decent Windows 8 or 10 laptop. And no matter what happens during a flash, if you guys screw it up somehow, a kid trips over a cord, uh, we can fix it. There has never been anything that we can't do. Uh, it might involve a, a call to us, but we can revive a dead ECU so you don't have to worry about bricked ECUs and, and stuff like that that you may have to with other flash devices. The number one question that we get at TorqueLink is, can Skidoo see if my ECU has been flashed? And we are not here to manipulate warranty in any fashion. And yes, if Skidoo Engineering gets in there, they can see your ECU has been flashed. But the good thing about the way we write our flashes is that they are safe and your sled will perform just like it's designed to perform from the factory with our tune in it because we do a full tune from the ground up and we make sure that we hit every part of the spectrum to make sure that you get what you think you're getting. You can see that while we're flashing, there's a, a 10 horse, 20 horse, 30 horse, and 45 horse. Uh, one of the biggest questions we get, what octanes are safe with these? On the 10, 20, and 30, a good 91 octane fuel is just fine. On the level four, the 45 horse, uh, you definitely want to run a straight 100 octane. If you don't run enough octane on a level four, it's not good. You're going to be running off the uh, detonation sensor and that's when bad things can happen. So you want to make sure if you're running the 45 horse tune that you do have good 100 octane fuel in there. And by 100 octane fuel, we mean 100 octane race gas or if you have a uh, half 110 race gas and 91 octane, that's good because it averages out. People like to ask us, what about avgas or aviation fuel, like 100 LL or 110 LL? Uh, we do not recommend running 100 LL or 110 LL for the fact it's a drier fuel. A lot of times there is a, a de-icing agent in there like alcohol, ethanol uh, at, a, at a higher percentage. And sometimes that doesn't mix with the two-stroke oils and it's a drier fuel. So 
Here at Torque Link, Bike Man, we don't recommend 100LL or 110LL. So that's how easy it is. This is Joey Strube, Torque Link. Uh, check out all our stuff at torquelink.com and you can also be purchased at bikemanperformance.com or through any of our Torque Link dealers.